Hey guys, Kirby Vacuum Collector and Fixer here, and I got this package from my friend Walker, who's right here. Hi. I'm sure you guys remember him from the past. Uh, he he has a tech channel about, you know, talking about, I don't know, tech stuff. Be, feel free to check him out, Walker Kirchman. Um, so, yeah, he sent me a package, uh, and I'm sending him a package too. Okay, I got the package out here, so I'm going to open it now. So, packed it pretty good and nice. Is that a knife? It's a envelope knife. Oh man, he's got a knife. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Ooh, foam. That'll help with uh, your package. Yeah. Okay, so. All right, so far it looks nice. We got some foam. Um, oh, well, I got me, uh, okay, these letters, envelopes. All right, 513. It's a 513, everybody. Um, handle, which is in here. Um, let me try. Ah, there's an opening in the bag here. Like, just pull it out. So here's the handle, appears in good shape, perfectly round too, so the handle, and then we got this green cord, well here's this little cord first actually, um, I've been needing a cord for my Model 30, um, you said it doesn't fit perfectly, but it fits. Yeah, it's compatible. Yeah, so this will work, so I can finally run my Model 30 for you guys, which will be nice. So, yeah, I got this. And then here's the cord that's connected to the machine. It's a D80 cord. Um, I'm probably going to have to replace it, considering that there's a huge gash right here. So, but it'll do for now. Um, so, yeah, that's the cord. So, we just wind this up. Um, pretty excited. I mean, this is not my first 513. I have one right here, but, uh, the one from Walker is going to stay as is, and then the one I have here is going to get restored. So, all right, more foam. And then we've got the Heritage 2 topper that I've been needing. This actually came from me originally, and it's back now, so, yeah. Then... We've got this uh, mini package right here, actually. Oh yeah, it's the uh, a an old dusting brush, Electrolux compatible, probably Hoover compatible as well. So yeah, that'll come in handy. Um, and then we've got the handle grip, and it's ah, it's the older. This is an early 513 because it's got the stationary cord hook, the extra tall. It's extra tall, and it's got the smaller end to it, so that's nice. Um, and so then we got this, the handle fork, right here. Uh, some more foam. And this bag also came from me originally. Um, it was actually... a. When I, I first had it on the my 508 when Matt Jones first gave it to me, and now I have it back. So, um, oh, here's the machine. Packed nicely on top of foam. Great packaging. And the, cor and the uh, pin for the handle. And this bag is, okay, there we go. So, put this over there. So, that, this machine is actually nicer than I thought, to be honest. It looks better in person. So, so, yeah. It's, uh, the, I know the headlight bumper and the, the belt lifter is original. The grip is original, except for the, uh, the only thing not original about the grip is the actual rubber sleeve, but the grip itself is original. 
the handle, the mid, the mid section of the handle is original. The empter tray is also original. Um, and it's really nice. Oh, the tag is pretty wobbly, and there's no brush roll, but that's that's perfectly fine. So I can just use one off the, my other machine. But yeah, my 513. Let me see if I can put this together right now. You're gonna, I put the screws for the handle in the holes, so you're gonna have to unscrew the screws first. I see that right here. Yeah. So, yeah, it's nice. Um, just making sure, I mean, there's no particular way. I just like to put it in the way that it was. Yeah, I think the longer side, um, the longer mark is the one that goes in the fork. Okay, yeah, because I like putting it in the way it was originally. Yeah, I can see that now. <laughs> so, tighten this. Okay, then the grip. I don't think I need to unscrew this. I can just leave that because it slips on perfectly. And then make sure it's aligned. Because I, 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 it bugs me to no end when they aren't perfectly aligned. When the grip isn't perfectly aligned with the back of the machine, it has to be aligned or else I will change it. So it's aligned. Yeah, that, huh? that would drive me crazy. Yeah, so I have it aligned so it's tightened so putting the cord on so I'm just gonna wrap that around wrapped around and then the, finally the bag so this 513 is assembled and it looks pretty nice the only thing I need to do is uh, put oh, is put trim on it the headlight and I have new old stock red trim from the 50s so that'll that won't be a problem so yeah so that's my 513 it's really nice um, I'll have a video on it sometime soon. Uh, thanks for watching, Walker, one more time. Bye. So, thanks for watching. Have a good day.